My name is James Hunt and I'm an Associate Professor in Crop Agronomy at La Trobe University and I'm also the course coordinator for the Bachelor of Agricultural Sciences. Today I'm going to talk about some good reasons why you might want to study agricultural sciences and why you might want to study agricultural sciences at La Trobe University. So firstly let's talk about why study agricultural sciences and the reasons are extremely compelling. Humanity is about to face a very serious challenge in terms of its ability to feed itself. The world population is going to be 10 billion by the year 2050. And in order to feed all those extra people that will be on the planet, we need to double food production in that time. We not only need to double food production, but we need to do it on the same area of land that we have to farm now, perhaps with slightly less and we need to do it with less fossil fuels and with more climate shocks. And it is your generation that's going to have to, to meet this challenge, and that requires a lot of people with good agricultural science training. Because of this oncoming demand for food and food products, employment prospects for people with an agricultural science degree are extremely favourable right now and likely to be that way into the future. So why study agricultural sciences at La Trobe University? We have outstanding student experience and quality of education as demonstrated by our performance in the Compare Ed series of surveys that the government conducts. And you can go and look at the results of these surveys of current students and graduate students at the Compare Ed website. Uh, we also have an outstanding research reputation and research evaluation, which I'll talk about shortly. These are the results from the Compare Ed website for universities in southeastern Australia that offer an agricultural sciences degree. As you can see, La Trobe University either ranks first or second in all of these important parameters that prospective students should be considering before they undertake a degree. And if you compare the universities that are just in Victoria, you will see that we're clearly the best and often by quite a large margin. And I'd like you to pay particular note to the employment, the percentage of our graduates that have found employment by the time they are surveyed. You will see this compares very favourably to our main competitor, the University of Melbourne. The second point is that we are the best in Victoria for research. These are the results of the Excellence in Research Australia, series of evaluations that the Australian Research Council undertakes. And again, you can find these results on the internet at the website given. And you can see that La Trobe receives five, which is the highest possible ranking, which is well above world standard for all the areas in which it researches that relates to agriculture. And most importantly, we have five out of five for agricultural and veterinary science studies. Additional advantages of studying at La Trobe are that we have a small class size. So typically we have about 30 students enrolling in a given year and you will go through university with that same cohort. So it's very comfortable, everyone knows each other and it's very familiar and friendships are formed which last for life. We also have scholarships, La Trobe Agricultural Science Scholarships and you will be eligible for other scholarships offered by different providers for students undertaking studies in agricultural science. The Bachelor of Agricultural Sciences is also offered as a double degree with commerce. The ATAR for the Bachelor of Agricultural Sciences itself is about 60. The ATAR for the double degree, which is a four-year degree, is about 80. As I mentioned at the start, employment outcome for students is currently excellent. We really see agricultural sciences as the science degree you undertake if you're interested in science but really want to get a job once you graduate. And we have very diverse employment outcomes for all our graduates. This diagram shows some of the pathways into the degree, VCE, TAFE, and etc. Then do the three-year Bachelor of Agricultural Sciences degree and that instantly qualifies you for a broad range of careers and some of those are listed on the slide. There are many others but these are the careers that many of our graduates go into. You can also choose 
to do a fourth honours year, which provides you research training, which further opens up your options in terms of career to include research officers working for the state government or CSIRO, say. And that also opens up the pathway of a PhD, which gives you full research scientist training. Just quickly show you some of our graduate destinations. These three photos are from three of our graduates. The one on the top left is a photo taken by Anika Paradown, who is now a consultant in Southwest Victoria. So she works directly with growers to advise them on how to best grow crops and pastures and run livestock in order to maximize their profitability and their sustainability. When she first graduated, she worked for a brief period for the state government. Then she went and worked for a grower group, which is a big destination for a lot of our graduates, before she finally went out on her own as a private consultant in Southwest Victoria. The other photo up the top is Helena. Once she graduated, she volunteered at Australian Volunteers International in the Pacific Islands. And once she finished that experience, she came back and got a job for the federal government for the Department of Agriculture. Down the bottom, we have Laura, who graduated with honours, so she had that additional research training. And straight out of her honours, she got a graduate position at Landmark as a retail agronomist. And she worked at that for a year before she decided she really wanted to go back into research. And she worked at CSIRO as a research officer, and she's still there now. Thanks very much for listening. I hope you found the reasons for studying agricultural sciences at La Trobe compelling, and I'm looking forward to answering any questions you might have after this presentation. Thank you.